crowns on our head. Ezra's two. Ezra's two. Second Ezra's two. We're going to put crown on our head. Crowns on our head. That's why he's the king of kings. Lord that's a, Lord. That's a two and two. Yeah. And second Ezra's two and 42. I, I also saw upon Mount Sinai a great people whom I could not number. The great people that he could not number is Israel. Like I said, Israel is greater than the sands of the seashore and the stars of heaven. YouTube video, uh, YouTube page is all into the Yeah. But if you get to Twitter, I got links. You can follow the links for all that. You know what I mean? I got a billion videos posted on there. Yeah. All over the world. I also saw from Mount Sinai a great people whom I could not number, and they all praised the Lord with songs. That says the same thing as Revelation. But it was that great multitude. You know? And in the midst of them, there was a young man of high, of a high stature. A young man of high stature. You know? Taller than all the rest. That's the son of the Most High. He's taller than everybody. You know? And upon every one of their heads, he set crowns. It was more exalted, which I marveled at greatly. So I asked the angel and said, Sir, what are these? He answered and said unto me, These be they that have put off the mortal clothing and put on the immortal. Yeah, put off the mortal. You're supposed to say, like, like, this, like First John says, love not the world, neither the things that are in it. You ain't supposed to be all caught up in this, all this worldly bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Always worried about appearances and worried about who got the most money. You talking about getting money. You know what I'm saying? Caring about none of the material bullshit, right? And then he watched that. <laughs> Huh? Let's <laughs> <laughs> say you're okay. This is a This It's just books that was taken out of the Bible. Uh, it's all part of the Bible. See, authorized king. Like you pose, like, uh, like, like you. Like you ain't supposed to be falling in love with none of these nasty ass hoes. You know what I'm saying? Right. You are uh, King James 1611 version of the Bible. You can go buy it. You can have it. Oh yeah. Because yeah. you got some devil. This is a bad book. Like stuck. Because you got some devil worshippers. They try to tell you that's not part of the Bible. And this is a King James Apocrypha. During the time of King James, if you publish a King James Bible without the, these books in it, then you, you could get imprisoned or fined. Yeah, you know, I, I can tell he knows a lot anyway. Uh, I can tell you a brother anyway. Just by the way you're standing. Oh, oh okay. You know, you I can thought, just I thought, you said, I thought that was a bad that? twin. You can just tell. You can tell your brother, man. But you probably, through your mind, you think you're so white, father. man. Where's you know where's where's father? Father? Norwegian. Hey, he said Norwegian. Hey, you know the Vikings are Israelites. That's right. Hey, don't you know? I was just watching some your boys from Iceland. They had the strongest men in the world. Strongest men in the world. Yeah. The strongest men in the world are Vikings. Some of them uh, up in Iceland. And it's some of the strongest people on earth. You know what I'm saying? always Well, the Vikings are Israelites. You know what I'm saying? Because you see, they they all converted from that paganism. And they was all following the ways of the Bible. Don't you know Vikings conquered England? And they, and they became the kings of England? A lot of people don't know that. Yeah, yeah, the... Uh, the Normans. Yeah, because that's when... Oh, that's that the show. The Romans started yeah, losing a, a lot of their show. empire oh, right because now. of the Germans, which was come from up north. The original Germans are actually... Oh, yeah, the Germans, the Germans and the Vikings are the same people. That's yeah, that's saying. what I'm saying. It's a, yeah. And another thing too, do you know the story of Odin is actually is actually a bastardization of the, of the story in the Bible? Because you, you know the story because the the worship the Odin worship of Odin, you know the oldest writings of uh, the Norse myths and poems and the the Eddas or whatever. They're only like a thousand years old. The Bible is two thousand years old. The New Testament, the New Testament is like two thousand years old, right? That's way older than that Norse shit. But it, but uh, in the story of Odin, they say Odin was was, uh, was sacrificed on a tree and stabbed in the side with a spear. You know that? Where did they get that from? That comes right from the Bible. That's a that's a plagiarized story of the Bible. Yep. That's all it is. But but then they they, they that's the same thing the ancient Israelites did. They took the Bible and mixed it with a bunch of heathen shit. They started sacrificing children. You know what I'm saying? Started celebrating Christmas. Mm -hmm. You know you ain't supposed to celebrate Christmas. You ain't supposed to celebrate no damn Easter. 
And that's all, you know, the Norse, the, the, when they was pagan, worship of Odin and Thor, they celebrated Easter. You know what I'm saying? Sacrifice people to Odin. They, you know, you know the Norse pagans, and they would, uh, they sacrificed nine of every kind of animal. Any kind of animal they had around, they had to sacrifice nine of them, including people. Why not? Huh? Why? That's that, that's that magic number nine. <laughs> John Lennon had a song called Number Nine. You know what I'm saying? You heard that song? Huh? Three of the numbers. Well, every number got some kind of significance yeah. to it, you know? You can't get too bugged out on numbers. Why, man? But yeah, you know, you know America's about to be destroyed. Well, uh, I would ask. Where are you from? Yeah. Could you tell me something about the man? Where are you from, Egypt? How do you know? I was just guess. I was just trying to guess. Oh, uh, no, where are you from? No, I'm curious. I'm just curious. I'm a people person. I'm curious. Uh, Ethiopia. Oh, Ethiopia. Okay. Okay. I thought he was a Jake. You know what I mean? Yeah, you a Jake. You know, these people are scattered in this. Those Ethiopian people. Yeah. But that's why that's the time. Yo, you, you know how to play those guitars. There's a bunch of homosexuals. You gonna make sure this whole thing cool. Yeah. <laughs> Who left the battle? Huh? Who's it gonna stop? I can't hear you. Who left the battle? Who's it gonna stop after the world was created? After the world was created? Who what? Who started the music color stop and the instrument? The music? Yeah. Before the world was created? This After the world was created. Well, what, what you, well, actually, you read in the Bible, in the Old Testament, and it says one of the descendants of Cain uh, actually invented the first instrument. Cain, as you say, It was Cain? one of his descendants. I can not I can look it up, actually. I'll get it for you. Yeah. One of, one of his sons? Yeah. He was cursed, and he couldn't stay here on the bed. But not saying nobody would kill you otherwise. Seven times that much what it's you did to your brother. Yeah. So. Oh, I got it right here. Look. And this is Genesis. Genesis 4 and 21. And this is, uh, this is one of the brothers of uh, Jabal. I'll just start at 20. These are all descendants of Cain. And out of bear Jabal, he was the father of such that dwell in tents and of such as have cattle. And his brother's name was Jubal. He was the father of all such as handled the harp and organ. What's your musical instruments? Yeah. Yeah, I know I that. They start to drum, but I would say what I'm reading, you might read more than that, but I read about Kyle and Ariel and what he did. Who? Cain and Abel? Cain and Abel, oh, yeah. and Abel and the first two guys. Yeah. <laughs> that's the, second, the second is it Adam and Abel, the first of them. Jacob and Esau. Oh, yeah. You know Jacob and Esau, right? Yeah, uh, I, Esau? Esau. Esau is red, Jacob's brother, Esau. Esau, Esau, yeah. How do you say we'll it over say, there? We say pronounce it Esau. 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 Uh, Esau. I shall, yeah, Esau. Esau. But anyway, that is a very letter, very letter thing. Well, but, uh, Esau is the same spirit as Cain. The same spirit. The same uh, evil spirit. But uh, I don't know. From what he read, he was doing everything he could for his own father. He was hunting, bringing, and um, doing it the, mid, the way his father wants. And at the last time, he <coughs> wanted to press him, and the father heard that, and what that pressing was for his 
younger brother but, from Jacob. But, but, however, before, hold on, before Jacob and I saw were born, before they were born, God, the Most High, prophesied that the elder would, uh, the elder, the older Esau would serve Jacob, that he would be Jacob's servant. Before they were born, it was prophesied. So, so, uh, so what Jacob did was not evil. It was the act of God. Jacob deceiving his father was prophesied by God. That was God that did that. I think you are right there, but uh, who of those uh, prophecy? Who, who were they? Look at these freaks. What, they were human beings. Right? No, the most high. Read it for him, uh, Genesis yeah. 25. Okay, read it. Which one do you want me to start at? Start? That's the spirit because we just, uh, yeah. the, el the elder, the elder, two um, men are separated. Okay, here you go. This is Genesis 25 and 23. And the Lord said unto her, it's a pagan. Y'all worship Apollo and Afro, Afro, uh, what's the Aphrodite? Aphrodite, baby. Yeah, yeah you ain't telling that homosexual shit. Yeah, but, uh, but uh, what you say, prophesy for a gold. So, who are these prophesies? The, prophet, the prophets, the twelve, prophets. The 12 disciples, they were men of the Lord. They were, they were men of the Lord. We're prophets. Yeah, but who are they? Men of the Lord. Israelites. Uh, Israelites, but what kind of people? In relation to God, what the kind sons of, of the sons of God, they yeah, the, the elect, elect, uh, the elect. They were people. Yashuala. Yashuala, yeah. They were elected, and what they say was actually the voice of God. And everything exactly. was exactly. Right, 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 right. Yes, right. yes. Yeah. Right, right here, this is Moses. Moses wrote this. Yep, yep, yep. Um, and it, um, like, I know, Ethiopia, I know Ethiopia is a Christian country, right? Yeah, but uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, many of you, you know, coming no there, and uh, that's the Jew, that's the Jews pushing, flooding you with the with the Muslims. Yeah, yeah, well, uh, that, is it a Christian country? Actually, before Europe became Christian, the king of Ethiopia, actually, king of Ghana became Christian. Right. Yeah, from that time, right. even you might wonder, but we have churches in Ethiopia, right. in right. caves, right. in oh. caves, mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. caves. And that myself, I criticized, not knowing, of course. I didn't like, why they, why they put it in a cave a church or something, you believe it, when they can build it in a nice place or something, I will say. But I read now that Christ was born in a cave. Well, in a manger, yeah. In a cave. So that uh, I but besides, that uh, the the New Testament says the temple of God is not made with hands. It's not made with human. This is the temple. Yeah, this is yeah, the yeah. church. This yeah. right. This and there the was temple. no church then uh, uh, only the temple. Yeah. Right. This is this is the temple. Uh, okay. Right now we're, we're being in the spirit. We're in the temple of God. You know. And this is Jerusalem, right here. Right here, where we're standing. This is Jerusalem. Yeah. Each one of us. Okay. All right. All right. That's all right. Uh, but uh, the the Jews were immigrated to Egypt and finally became slaves for 400 years there. And uh, God was so good taking Moses. They used there in the. Uh, we was all there in the Red Sea, crossing with Moses. We was all there. That was us. You were there. Uh, yes, we was. Reincarnation. Most, the reincarnation. You understand real, the word reincarnation? Most, most probably we were. We were. <laughs> most probably we were. You probably but, had dreams about it. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I want to explain that. 
the Israelites also God was showing them everything, doing them everything, but I don't think that they were any good at all. Most, most, you're right, most were wicked. They, they wanted to go back to Egypt. Uh, exactly. They complained. And the matter that Moses even that the complaining against the hey, people. Get, yeah, Jeremiah 4 and 22. Because yeah. our people are foolish. Our people are stupid. Yeah. Israelites are stupid. They're the, dumb, they're the dumbest people on the planet. <laughs> the, our, the God's people are dumb and stupid. Because they're, they're spoiled. They're, they're spoiled. spoiled. Selfish, spoiled. But, but, right. But Rats. I would say, <laughs> so I'm explaining it to myself, my own self. From what I read, they were doing everything bad against the God. Hey, hey, worse but, than the devil. But, I'm thinking now the world is in America, in Same. China, in everything. We are the people who are doing the same thing, killing the people, the, 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 you know, oh, so doing everything. Yeah. So what you are saying, I like, we all are bad. Uh, we are not there all, there's an, there's, We have something called the elect. The Lord's going to save the elect of Israel. Because the Bible says, a few shall be saved. Only a few shall be saved. Uh, many are called, but few are chosen. Yeah. Hey, read that scripture for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 I understand if you tell me, you know, uh, from what you read, after all, not everything correctly, but what, from what I'm, I read, I'm telling you, so if you tell me... Oh, you're right, though. He's, huh? that's, 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 He's right, though. Most that's faith. Hey, get Isaiah. I'll get it. Isaiah 63. Be good. Yeah. Jeremiah 4 and 22. Jeremiah 4 and 22. This is the description. This is what the Lord has to say about his own people. This, this the majority of our people are like this. Not all. Not, not all, but most. All right, read it. And this ain't, yeah, right. Jeremiah 4 and 22. For my people is foolish. He said, for my people is foolish. You they know? have not known me. And not know me. Keep going. They are sodish children. Sodish. Sodish means stupid. When you look it up in the dictionary, it means stupid. Keep going. And they have none understanding. They have no understanding. None. Zero knowledge. Zero wisdom. They, no, they, no, they know nothing. Keep going. They are wise to do evil. They, they, they're, they know a lot about doing evil. They're educated in evil and wickedness. Keep going. But to do good, they have no knowledge. They have to do. They have no knowledge of righteousness. That, that's our people. Look, look at these women. You see these women out here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what are they? I'm reading. I read a little bit. I'm not. I wouldn't say I'm good reader, but I'm reading. You speak and English I'm pretty hearing, good. I'm hearing radios, TVs, and trying to understand myself. And only my flesh remain there. I am my body going over there in front of God and the heart. Yeah, yeah, very spiritual man. Yeah, yeah. 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 We all we all got a report to the Father. Yeah, we have to, to report. We have to report. And, yeah. and from what thing? What the Israelites also, they were being led by God. They were being told every time they were doing it bad, but I was blaming the bad people and stuff that are all wrong. Look in my head. We are all the same today. We are not any better at all. I don't know about that. We are not any better. I don't know about that. Here you go. This is Ecclesiastes 12 and 7. Then shall the dust return to the earth as it was. This is uh, talking about reincarnation. Or right, this is what happens when you die. Not reincarnation, but it does. Right. Go into, and, and this proves there's no such thing as hell. Okay, when we die, we all go to the Father. Nobody oh. goes to hell. That's right. Okay. Then shall the dust return to the earth as it was, and the spirit shall return unto the most high who gave it. That's, that's where we're that's all just what That's you just where said. we're all headed. Uh, yeah, but that's what one thing, one thing. It says in the book I have about the angels, 
uh, the angels was created first of all before the whole universe was yeah they're our, and our they, they're our brothers yeah they, they are most wise and beautiful but they are free they have no body you know the spirits yeah they are spirit like yes. god is but uh and uh, he was giving them everything, everything. So what the Israelites was doing, I'm seeing now what we are doing. We are people here, uh, here across the continent, somewhere in Africa or here, everywhere. We are men and nobody does what God wants. And God gave us freedom by free will. This free will, he is so good. Is this free will. I'll go ahead. He got something for you. I got some. This is a few of us that's going to be saying. This is um, this is Second Ezra 8 and 1. And he answered me saying, the Most High made this world for many, but the world to come for few. The world to come. That's the kingdom of heaven. Keep going. I will tell thee a similitude, Ezra, as when thou askest the earth, it shall say unto thee, that it giveth much more whereof earthen vessels are made, but little dust that gold cometh of, even so is the course of this present world. There be many created, but few shall be saved. But few, few shall be saved. Most people just simply gotta die. They gotta, they gotta be destroyed. God, and now look, the Lord is bringing. Hey, get Isaiah 66. Oh, that's my first thing. That's a beautiful that's scripture. It. Hey, that's it. You'll agree with this one. Let's we'll get something we can agree on. Isaiah 66 and 15. Let me, let me read this scripture for you. This is going to explain because the Lord can say it better than us. Isaiah 66 and 15. For behold, the Lord will come with fire. With fire. And with his chariots, chariots, so-called UFOs, like a whirlwind. That's the Lord's chariot. To render his anger with fury, and his rebuke with flames of fire. That's the Lord bringing flames and fire. He go hold on a second. For by fire, and by his sword, the Lord swords and chariots and the fire. Keep going. Will the Lord plead with all flesh? Keep going. And the slain of the Lord shall be many. The slain of the Lord shall be many. What you are saying and what, what I read, I mean, we all scared the fire. I, I myself scared very much. <laughs> but this is the sign of God because yep. the angels who are closer to God, they simply burn the fire. Right. Burn the fire. That's it. Yeah, we are so fire is God's thing, it's so all a Break sign clean. of that. So Break clean, well, yeah, a fire to... cleans. A fire makes a clean. Best cure. Yeah, yeah fire to, clean. To kill a yeah. to kill a diseased body, you gotta burn them, you know? <laughs> so by the way, many of you have you had a dream that related to religion because in olden days the people were dreaming. We have dreams all the time. All the time. Yeah. Well, we talk. We'll talk to each. You can crazy. Yeah, crazy stuff can happen. You. We have. I've had dreams about nuclear missiles. About uh, you know missiles, uh, mushroom clouds, missiles uh, exploding everywhere, mm. getting attacked. Mm. You know what I mean? Okay, They've had dreams. Good. I've had dreams about tsunamis, hurricanes, tornadoes. You know. Yeah. Yeah, they, so let me, you are most probably, I imagine you are most probably. I have a dream. And this dream was not when I was in normal case. I, you know, in different parts of the world, I'm from Africa, and where I was uh, uh, born, there are malaria everywhere. Right. I was infected by malaria and I was sick and I was in the countryside, no doctor, nothing, and there was no way they could uh, 
they could harm me, me though they could treat me mother and father, nothing, nothing. And uh, then my father tried logically find the tent here and there everywhere. He couldn't find it. So he brought his clothes so very a child and uh, he cried. But mother cried and shout and called to the neighbors and uh, she said before I say no and she said oh, she crazy to dead, dead person just uh, gonna you know smell you know and uh, everything is destroyed and he left her wow. but later on after a day she found the tent now and my eyes started to open. But during this time, I can't say a sin, uh, I can't say dream, because it was absolutely showing me. I found uh, an elderly person, I was born somewhere in the countryside, an elderly person dressing like and then I look into him, I give him an answer, and he say, you have to learn, you have to learn, he said. And then I come to my then when I turn to the right, I say, such a horrible place. I can't say yeah, I can't simply express in what is I knew all kinds of suffering comes from that place, that dark place, a true dark place. And all my physical and stuff yeah. was And then I passed that and turned to the right and I saw beautiful plant with three, three, uh, with three branches. That plant was so attractive that it looks like water was dropping from there. Then I went to that place. As I came to that place, horrible thing that happened to me. Uh, this thing is you might translate it into my Then there came a judgment that I should walk on a gillet. On a gillet. Gillet, you know, you know, you gillet, you check. Oh, okay. I have to walk. No way, I mean to the left, to the right, to behind, nothing. Yeah. This was. This was the last judgment I have to walk I have to walk there. And then from the spare, all my body, from teeth, bones, skin, water, what is it comes from the strap. The, the scare was so hard. But finally, God is great. Yeah, that's what you passed asked before we got out here, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I passed that. And came to the fireplace. Wow. A fireplace. In that fireplace, what there the were. Fuck was that? I have no idea. It's stunk, whatever. It three was. people whom I knew. One was already a priest when I was a child. Two of them were not priests, but they were already in the fire. The fire was that time. Horrible. You, said, you remember all that. Who was in the fire? You should write a book uh, about it. God damn. People whom I know, uh, those three people. I they were all in the fire. Yeah. You say that, did you say the preacher was in the fire? The priest also was in the fire. So you just and tell this story to everyone? The came hey, did you, did you get that on camera? Yeah. All right, go ahead. And he came and greeted me, but uh, uh, his greeting, I was not 
very much accepting because I was scared looking around and on the right side horrible fire and in that fire a lot of people and now the guy the one who find me outside and told me you have to learn came in and at that time all Where's of them the are also in the fire all of them are also in the fire they Is were oh, yeah. smiling they were happy and it took me to translate this whole stuff of it. Myself. Okay, let me read this. Let me read this. <laughs> this is Joe 2 and 28. How much time is that, bro? Oh, it's almost dead. I right, hurry up and get that out. Joe 2 and 28. And it shall come to pass after that I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy, and your old men shall dream dreams. Your young men shall see visions. So yeah, so that's only an Israelite gonna have a vision like that. So, so finally, I translate that video. The first person, I mean, when I was unconscious, already put it, I said, the Father God. The first person who met me, the Father God. Then, the first flesh, what is the flesh? and all the suffering come to stop. That was hell. That was hell. Uh, you know, you know, this going. You know where hell is. Uh, this is going to hell right here. Yeah, yeah, but uh, you know. Oh, what? No, watch. Right, right, right. Soon it's going to be on fire. Yeah. What you, I, you, what what I, you probably seen? You you seen the destruction here? That's coming to America. And it's, it's, uh, other parts of the world, they're going to get it too. Yeah. Right after the skirt and the salt, the plant will create beautiful, uh, you know, branches. And that was so attractive. I want to get closer to that. And it looks like, like water was almost dropping from the leaves, you know. And yeah. when I came to that place, this judgment came and again, I was in such a scare that really, really, I can't even express it in words. Right, right. I understand. Right, right. Okay, here you go. And I passed there and I got to the place where a fire, but I was not in the fire myself. Only in That's good. Only That's good. good. Yeah, you don't want to be in that fire. <laughs> That's yeah. the last place. He, 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 right, right. He said the preacher was in the fire, right? Uh, the priest was in the fire. <laughs> that's a good sign. <laughs> yeah, yeah that's, a, that's a good vision you had. But right. After all, after all, if you remember, during Israel, when they were being ruled by the Romans, and when Christ was born, the wise men, I don't know somebody, different people, different side from the East anyway, right. somehow Iran, around that area they came, and we want to see the king being born here. It was probably, they knew they'd seen the star. Ah, uh, the yeah, sun. they had the star and they thought, oh, yeah. I am the king here, who can be the king, and so forth, you know. But you remember Saint John, his relative, whom son of the Saint uh, Zacharias. Yeah. Zacharias, well, then his wife taking a child, hearing that 